Hi, today we're going to talk about CBD and interactions with other medicines. Now, this is a very important subject, so you have to listen to this one. Wow, it's sunny today. So, uh, medication and CBD. Now, you know, everything is not that simple as many people think. But in the end, we have to make it simple because how are you going to live life if you don't simplify the subjects that are complicated? Any medication you take, or let me rephrase it, any chemical substance you're using to tranquilize yourself or to have an effect on your body has an effect. Now, how will CBD interact with your body? It's a big question. Depends on the chemical or drug you're using already. Now, if you take, for example, grapefruit, okay? Grapefruit is very interesting because when you go to the pharmacy and buy a drug, it will always say on the package, on most of the drugs, that you cannot consume this drug together with grapefruit. Because grapefruit inhibits the uptake of whatever chemical you're having. Now, that's very amazing, isn't it? That simple thing like grapefruit can interact with your drugs and actually block them from entering your body. That's why I think it's very important to eat grapefruit every day. Because whatever chemical or poison you're getting in the supermarket is not going to enter your body. Grapefruit is going to stop it. When you take CBD with any other drug or chemical, you should be a little bit cautious because CBD many times, according to research and the experience I have, um, increases the uptake of whatever you're taking. So if you're taking morphine, for example, and you're taking CBD, now you need half the morphine you used to take because of some complex movements in your body through the cell membranes and stuff like that. So basically I would always say to people, if you're taking another drug together with CBD, take it easy, you know, go slowly with the CBD. That's why we created the optitration. You know, you take more and more and more CBD and you take less and less of the drug you are using. Uh, we see it like, for example, people with diabetes, uh, they use a lot of insulin, but after they start on CBD uh, and down to trade insulin, after a couple of months, they don't need it anymore. Maybe that's why this movement is so important. Um, bottom line is CBD and other drugs is okay. Just be careful because it increases the uptake of whatever you are having most of the time. Again, depends of course on the drug you're having. But as always, my grandmother told me and my father told me and I'm telling everybody, use your brain, okay? If you're doing something novel, okay, take it easy. Experiment, listen to your body, take a little bit, see how it affects you. If you see, whoa, it's a big rush, okay, take less of the other drugs or take less of CBD. Always be rational. Think, you have a mind, your mind is unique. You're gonna do amazing stuff with your brain. Just use it and stop watching YouTube all the time, all right? Okay, stay tuned. Next movie is gonna be about terpenes. It's a little bit related to this because terpenes do many things. Oh, bye. See you next time.